Hello there and welcome to what is our favourite time of the week. It is time for story time at the Garrick. I hope you've all been doing well since we last saw you. So today's story is all about a very strange place. It's written by Jeff McLean, it's been sent in to us and it's an absolutely amazing story. I cannot wait to tell you all about about it because it's about the very very weird zoo. Uh, I don't know if you've been to a zoo before. I have, I love zoos and I cannot wait to go back to them when they reopen. So I hope you're sitting comfortably and cosily and you have your cup of tea. I know I've got mine and if you're ready then I'll begin. So I woke up today and thought what can I do? And I had the idea that I would visit the zoo. My friends they, they told me that our zoo was quite strange but it sounded like fun and it would be a change. As I went through the gate, I could tell things were weird. I saw a giraffe with a big bushy beard and monkeys all swinging about in the trees but with yellow and black stripes just like big bumblebees. A lemur jumped out with sharp lion's teeth and an anteater's nose with tusks underneath. A large scary tiger looked at me like her food but she opened her mouth and instead she just rooed. A meerkat was curled up asleep on the lawn, but when she looked up she had a rhinoceros horn. A zebra ran past with black and white spots and, and a big grizzly bear with pink and green dots. And along came a hippo with a, with a long furry tail and a very slow cheetah being caught by a snail. A leopard was prowling with an elephant's trunk. Inside was a dolphin asleep in a bunk. I turned when I heard a great lion's roar. Behind me was just a tiny mouse on the floor. A penguin appeared with large kangaroo's feet. He waved at me once, then hopped off down the street. Getting ready to leave, I shouted goodbye, just as a seal flew past in the sky. As I made my way home with a smile on my face, I thought to myself, what a very strange place. Well, what a fantastic story that was. I had a fantastic time telling it. So thank you, Jeff, for sending it in. It's much appreciated. As for you, if you want to keep the fun going, then we have a zoo-based craft, I believe, in the description below. As always, stay safe, stay positive, and we'll see you soon.